welcome to Hey Dr. Sue. So people submit their sex questions to me anonymously, and once a week I post one question and one answer. Do you have a sex question you've always wanted answered? Go ahead and check out the description for information on how to submit it anonymously. This week's question is, I would like to ask about certain diseases and if it is bad for a girl to have sex when she's on her period. It's not bad for a girl to have sex on her period, and there may actually be some benefits to it, but there are some things both people need to do before deciding to have period sex. The first thing each person needs to do is figure out if they're cool with it. Not everyone is into the idea of having sex when there's blood present, so if both people are into it, then it's a no-go. If everyone is okay with it, then you're going to need to do a little bit of prep. I suggest putting something underneath you, like a towel or sheet you don't care about, because there's a good chance this is going to get messy. Keep in mind that it's totally possible that people think they're cool with period sex, and then when they start experiencing it or they see the blood, they're suddenly not okay with the idea. I suggest checking in with each other as things go on, just to make sure everyone really is comfortable with what's happening. That's actually a good piece of advice for sex play in general. Had the talk, got the towel, but you still need a couple more things. I suggest having some lube handy. While blood can make things slippery, it doesn't mean that there'll be enough of it to make things pleasurable, and it can be uncomfortable if there's not enough lubrication. So have lube nearby. You can always choose not to use it if you don't need it. Also have a condom. Diseases are absolutely concerned during period sex, and using a condom will help prevent the transmission of STIs, including HIV. And speaking of prevention, just because a girl's on her period doesn't mean she can't get pregnant. While the chances are low, it's still possible, especially if she's a short, short menstrual cycle. Yet another reason to wear a condom, although the pregnancy concern may be less of an issue if she's already using another method of contraception. There are some benefits to having period sex. If you orgasm, it's possible that it will help reduce the pain from menstrual cramps or other pain you have during your period, like headaches. This is because your body releases natural painkillers when you orgasm. These natural painkillers come from any orgasm, not just partner play. So if period sex isn't an option, you could always masturbate. Another benefit of period sex is possible bonding. Some people say that it makes them feel closer to their partner. To sum it up, period sex isn't good or bad. It's really a matter of personal comfort and maybe taking some extra steps to prep and clean up when you're done. Until next time, be safe and have fun. Did you like that video? Check out the description to find out about other ways to contact me, including Instagram, Twitter, and Substack. And remember to like and subscribe.